Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Hello, good evening to you, and part of the story here is the Albight Stadium by night, 60,000 capacity here. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an excited match. And here's the Qatar starting 11. Well, it looks as though they're lining up fairly defensively with a back five. But I think the wing-backs will have license to get forward at every opportunity. And also watch out for one of the central midfield players going to join the front two. This is what they'll be facing today. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And the game begins. Estrada Moises Caicedo moving it forward but they took care of the situation defensively Abdulaziz Hatem Franco Might be able to set up the chance. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Away again here, one nil to score. Asim Madibo, Hatem, Madibo, Akram Afif. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defense? Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Moises Caicedo. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Estrada. 
Grueso. Now Estrada. Excellent passing. It's a weighted pass. Gonzalo Plata. Shot attempted. Straight forward for the keeper. Afif. Alhaidos. Ali. And he has options available. Now potential danger. Oh, it's off the post. No nonsense clearance. Well, they're so unlucky not to be level now. It was a great effort. You just wonder if they're going to regret that. Yes, so near indeed. But now they've got to concentrate on keeping their defensive shape. Firing it in. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. But he's gone short with it. Moises Caicedo. Must score! And getting across to stop it. Short corner taken. Franco. That is not going to do. Well wide of the target. Ali. Alhaidos. Akram Afif moving into the advanced position Afif Asim Madibo good work to regain possession Caicedo The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Estrada. A really sumptuous ball. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. Goal! Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. And we're focusing on him for a reason, Stuart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, the keeper will be sick at the sight of him. He's been shooting from everywhere and he's taken his goals really well. And so the battle commences. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half.
Well, he has the measure of his opponent. But no damage done. That's the main thing. Piero in Capier. Franco. Our possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. Moises Caicedo. Caicedo. Alan Franco on the offensive. He got in the way of that cross. Ahmed. Al Haidos. Could be a chance to break here. And can they prize them open now? And space to cross it. to get a body in the way Carlos Grueso Moises Caicedo running with the ball confidently now the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick now they're going to alter things here's the substitution Crossing towards the far post. Couldn't keep it. Into the final 20 minutes. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, it petered out. Estrada. Alan Franco. And space to attack. Is this the moment? Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Playing it short. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Akram Afif. Can they hit on the break? Abdulaziz Hatem. Well, strong play here. Could reduce the deficit. Marvellous anticipation. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Favouring the short one. And fine goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box and the referee doesn't hesitate that is a spot kick well they really need this and there it is, perfectly executed.
executed. Well, as you can see, the keeper makes no effort in the end. He was hoping it would be struck down the middle, but it's an easy finish, really. Well underway again, it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. Caicedo. We will have three minutes of additional time at the end here. Well, space if he goes inside, but nothing comes of it. Ali. Rubia. So with that, we can now say it's all over and the outcome they were hoping for, certainly. A victory, and you can't argue with that, Stuart. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer, and Stuart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.